Welcome to the part two of the KDP planner niches. So today we are going to look at five KDP planner niches with medium competition. So yesterday or the previous video, when you watch them, we have the part one of it. We had high competition. And today let's look at premium competition, KDP planner niches that you can publish. And what is KDP business? KDP planner uh, niches are niches that you can publish on the Amazon platform. And uh, you can also do more with that when it comes to Etsy. So this is Etsy. So you can publish some of these niches and uh, make some money just for digital downloads. So you can see people are doing digital downloads here on Etsy.com. And the prices are not that bad. Look at this. So uh, $3.75, $2, $7, all in one digital. Like, And these are like things that you can easily sell. And um, people will down look at this 50 mental health. Okay, this has like this is a post uh, planner, content planner. <laughs> but you can just publish this and you make money from that. You can also publish on Amazon. And today we are going to look at Amazon KDP for you. So if you are a publisher, these are some of the things I want to let you appreciate. Don't put a lot of content on Amazon. These days, if you like keep on publishing using one interior and publishing in like using one interior to be able to do different covers, you'll be found out one day and they may terminate your accounts. So make sure you follow, you, you keep on updating their, like you keep on reading their rules and regulations so that you can comply with it. And the beauty of this or the unfortunate thing of Amazon is that they will give you uh maybe next year they are going to revise their rules. And once they revise their rules, it can affect your product that you published in 2002. And they'll just take it down just because they've revived, revised that. So you need to constantly keep updating yourself to know more. So let's go to the niches. And I'm going to turn on this to uh, books because we want to do niche research. And these are like the niches of medium competition. So we have homeschooling planners. I'm just going to put that here. Homeschooling planners for you to be able to use. Homeschooling planners. These are uh, medium competition. Uh, okay. We have homeschooling planners. Okay, now I'm getting it. I messed that up. Sorry. So we have homeschooling planners, which have, uh, you can see homeschooling planners. So just search for this. And once you search for this, so this is like a homeschool mama lesson planner organizer. So these are like this. You can see, so it is selling a lot. You can see reviews, ratings, and I always look for ratings. If I have like people rating this, Homeschooling planner, mega homeschooling planner, and organizer. One thousand one hundred twenty-three planet uh, ratings. And this one, do your own research. I always say, do your own research when you take the list and do home planning, uh, whatever. Do your research to see can you publish in that? Is it easy for you to do? And once you know that you can be able to publish in this niche, go in for it. Plan your content. Go to uh, Canva create your own designs in terms of your cover pages and boom you are ready to uh, do more so this is the first niche the second niche is uh, pregnancy planners so this is for pregnant women and uh, people who will be able to uh, so you search we're just doing the search and I'll show you where to get the entire list the first mega, so this is it, the bump book, pregnancy planner, the bump book list of like, so there are a lot of planners that you can be able to use this too. Then let's go to the third one, gratitude journals. So this is also another planner and uh, it's in the gratitude niche, but it has medium competition and there are a lot of sales in this. There are a lot of sales that you can be able to make. And this, oh, you just have to know what to do and how to be able to make sure that you are discovered. So 
too, you can see that there are a lot of books here. I personally admire this book, Three Minutes Gratitude Jordan. And the inside is just something simple. And it has like 12,240. So close to 200,000 people have bought this book. Because only 10% of people will even leave ratings. So imagine the number of people who have bought this book. Spiral bound 18.99, people back 6.99. And this one is just something that a little baby can do. Design. See this one. This is just the design. This is all it is. Let me repeat this. It is all it is. This is all it has inside. Repeated. And people are buying and buying and buying and buying. So you can equally do that. So goal setting planners. So the next one is goal setting planners. So like I said, my duty is to bring you the niches and uh, teach you the niches. Your duty is to make sure you do your researches and uh, publish more. But this is a goal setting planner. And uh, this, the purpose of this is to just set goals. So search into it. We are going to see more and more of this for you to be able to use to create. And the last but not least is, and stay true, I'm going to give you some of the niches, where to get these niches. You can get a list of the 200 all. Garden and planners. So this is also for the agricultural niche, but it's part of the planners you can use. And this is like, people can buy this for business, backyard gardens, farms and stuff. You can see garden and chickens. <laughs> so just know what you want to do. And uh, if you learn to publish in this, you can be able to make traction, you can be able to make traction. So this is the entire list. It has like budget planners, it has this, all of this, college application planners, caregiver planners, job search planners. And it tells you whether it has low competition, high competition. And low competition simply means that once you start publishing in that, you are easily going to be found. They can easily find you. Why some of your books don't, people don't buy is that they don't easily find your books to buy because the competition is high. A high competition simply means that people are spending a lot of money to do promotions so that they can be discovered. And once they are discovered, they keep on doing promotions because they want to maintain on the top. So look for low competition. And uh, you can see these are all the list. So once you get this, you start using them, you start tra attracting, creating more opportunities with this. And uh, so you, if you don't mind, you can just copy this as I'm scrolling down can just have pen and paper, write some of them and start to publish in them. And that's how, if you are living in budget, that's what we used to do. Go watch videos, stuff. But if you have the resources, you can go to Creative Fabrica and you get the list. So, and not only the list, but like just registering, getting a now 4.99 per month you can download all of this you can download all of this on creative fabrica and that's the beauty of it you can download all of this on free creative fabrica so i'm going to share the list with you for you to be able to do more and see how you can be able to manifest and do your business thank you very much if i will bring you low competition niches in the part three of this so keep watching, like this, subscribe to my YouTube channel to get updates on your KDP business and how to make money using affiliate marketing. Thank you for your time. I appreciate your support.